Hello there fellow gamers, how are you doing? Now I am gonna teach you how to use an elytra in bedrock pocket edition. So let's get started. So now let me show you how an elytra works. Elytra is a thing which makes you fly in survival mode which is equipped at the back and it is found from the end ships by defeating the ender dragon and accessing the end gateway towards the end, end islands so let me show you how to use this elytra elytra is a thing which in it compare the speeds between the walking speed in the creative mode and the speed of an elytra so now i will activate my elytra and show you how fast is this guys so let's get started okay did you saw the difference between an elytra and the walking speed in creative mode you can fly very far distances very fast with this elytra now i'm gonna teach you how to land and take off perfectly with this elytra okay so let's get started okay guys so there are completely totally three ways to take off from ground and in creative mode you can okay in creative mode you can get access to flying option you can fly a bit higher drop down and press the jump button to activate your elytra and use fireworks to travel very far distances by this method you can travel very far distances using the elytra in minecraft so let me show you how to take off from the ground in survival mode okay now first there is there are three steps first one is you jump a block higher activate your elytra midair and take off this requires very practice patience and it is very lot difficult so we are gonna check with easy ways first you need is jump boost portion portion of leaping 2 and next one is slow falling portion so by the leaping portion you can jump higher and by the slow falling portion you can you will fall very slow using elytra in slow falling portion you fall very slow but slow falling is a bit terrible using elytra so always carry a milk bucket while using slow falling portion okay now the next now the next method is only leaping first try with slow falling and leaping portion next one is leaping boost 2 leaping 2 which will help you jump higher and press press jump button mid air to activate the elytra sorry did you catch it yeah i will show that for you again okay now we are gonna jump we are gonna jump activate the elytra did you saw it jump button and in the middle jump button in creative mode you can, by pressing double jump frequently you will go to into fly mode so be aware now i am gonna take off with this okay that's how you do it this is these two are the easiest methods now the next method is normal slow falling now let me take that milk now let me take the slow falling the slow falling portion will take you fall slow or from the sky which makes you more which gives you more time to use your firework rocket See, did you saw it? But always carry a milk bucket whenever you use slow falling to get up. Okay, these two are the these three are the easiest ways to fly. And now, if you you have to practice this many cup many times in creative mode to get perfect at this. And now, if you are ready enough, you have to use 
a portion of leaping which will make you jump way lesser than the leaping too. So this gives you less time to take off but it def surely works. These are the ways to take off but there is another way in which I will tell you teach you in a second. The hardest way is that the hardest way is that in which you have to jump only one block and activate your elytra and take out. See I am jumping very low. In that to activate my elytra it is very hard to activate my elytra. Did you saw it? Uh, the, sh the shortest time the elytra activates. At that time we have to be very aware and get our timing right to get off into the air. Okay. Now I am going to show you another method. Now I am going to show you the simplest and the cheapest method. You have to s uh, take a block of your, your wish and make a make a uh, may out place it go up like five to six blocks and then jump off activate your elytra and use your firework to get out from there i'll demonstrate it for you just a second did you see it that's how we fly the, uh, it is as easy as that Je this is the cheapest method to fly using an elytra to take off using an elytra now i am gonna teach you how to land using an elytra without taking any fall damage at perfectly okay now let's break this uh, uh, huge block, pile of blocks okay now i'm gonna go go into survival mode and take uh, show it to yourself just a second i'll switch uh, switch to survival mode okay guys now i'm in survival mode and i'm enabling fall damage so you know how much hard damage i'm taking so you can see the hearts on the top left corner okay now let me take off i'm using a jump boost portion uh, yeah i'm gonna take off now Did, that is how you activate an elytra and just a sec and we are out okay while using elytra you can reach insane speeds and we are gonna uh, try to land at the center of that circle okay we are traveling at the maximum speed right now now we have to slow down we have to slow down if we have to slow down, we have to turn around in circles at the point where you want to land. Never try uh, directly look down. That will cause damage very instantly. And it will make you fall. Take more circles and tilt towards where you want to land. It will give you a perfect and smoother landing. Okay, now I am gonna show you with the portion of leaping. Real, leaping 2 and leaping 1 does nothing different but leaping 1 makes you jump uh, much slow, lower so it, it is hard to take off I uh, saw it as a bit lag spike ok now this is one of my sneak peek around my base I'll make a complete tour on my base in just a couple of weeks. Okay. And now turning around and tilting around the point where you want to land makes the landing very much smoother. And by snow falling, I'm telling that it is very hard to take off, uh, t use slow falling because I'll show you in just a second. Yeah. See, I am now in slow falling effect and see, if I want to turn around and go back, I am completely stuck in the air, I move very rarely and it is very hard to tell and it is very annoying. So without slow falling portion, you move at a very higher speed at the point where you need to go.
In, while using slow falling potion and light right is very great to practice but it consumes a lot of rockets in the and rockets are very hard to make it needs to kill kill creepers and this is how you land perfectly i hope this video is helpful to you all If you find this video helpful please be sure to like and subscribe to my channel If you like my video this video will be forwarded by the YouTube recommendations to many other players you uh, you will be one of the person who will be helpful by liking this video to other persons have knowledge about the elytra so goodbye and take care